Now let's look at a problem dealing with the Egyptian numeration system. Write the following numeral as a Hindu Arabic numeral. And we have a number of symbols. Well, we're going to use a chart, and you can refer to this in your textbook also, in order to see what the symbols mean. We notice that we have our Hindu Arabic numerals in our first column, the Egyptian numerals in the second, and then a description of those Egyptian numerals to the right. So let's start off by noticing that the first symbol that we see looks like our pointing finger, and that stands for the value of 10,000. We have two of those, so this is going to be 10,000 plus another 10,000. Next we see our symbol, which is a spiral. We can locate that in our chart, and that's equivalent to 100. So we're going to have plus 100, plus 100, plus 100. And finally, we see the staff, which is equivalent to the number 1. So we'll have 1 plus 1 plus 1. Now that's going to give us then 20,000 plus 300 plus 3, and that then is 20,303 as a Hindu Arabic numeral.